Every year, more than a million people stream into the Art Institute of Chicago to catch a glimpse of a Sunday afternoon on the island of Le Grand Jatte, one of the most iconic paintings in Western art. And yet, while just about everyone who sees it can instantly appreciate the beauty and craftsmanship of this masterpiece, not all that many people know just how revolutionary it was. And even fewer people know much about the post-impressionist movement that lies behind it. A movement that paved the way for modern art and included some of the most incredible artists in history, including Paul Cezanne, Vincent van Gogh, Paul Gauguin, and Gustav Klimt. Well, I want to change that. I'm Ricky Allman, professor of painting and drawing at the University of Missouri, Kansas City. I'm also an artist, and one of my biggest influences has always been the revolutionary work of the post-impressionists. And over the next 24 lessons, I want to show you why. I want to take you up close into the world of the post-impressionists. We'll admire and analyze the great works of this era and look deeper at what caused the post-impressionists to think and feel the way they did but we'll also be taking a step back when we can to explore all the incredible changes happening all around them in science, politics, religion, society, and philosophy, and how the post-impressionists embraced, reflected, or rejected these changes in their art. I'll take you on a journey through the lives and works of some of art's biggest names, like Cezanne, Van Gogh, and Toulouse-Lautrec, and try to uncover what made them unique and so well-loved We'll also explore some of the lesser-known artists of the period whose work was equally groundbreaking. If the Impressionists unlocked the door to modernism, then the Post-Impressionists blew the door off its hinges. This was an incredible generation of artistic rebels and experimenters, and I hope you'll join me to find out why.